Hey, people, how you guys doing, man? How you guys doing? How you guys doing? Listen, I just come in from watching um, Donald Trump, Tom Hall meeting with CNN. And uh, I watched it from the beginning to the end. I just realized something. CNN decided to host President Trump today, I believe, for one reason, one reason only, to, to get the credibility back. So, uh, they want the American people to believe in them again. They didn't just bring Trump to CNN to, to do all that stuff just because they want to. No, no. They are doing it because they want to expose Trump as a liar, as all that. So, I watched it from the beginning to the end. The lady, the lady the, the, I can't be gay Trump time to speak. When he's speaking, she just cut him off. Oh, Mr. President, no, you are lying. Mr. President, you are lying. Mr. President, is that true? Mr. President, is that true? What a dare respect. So, so you American have no respect for your for your, for, 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 for your presidents. I just realized that that lady on the CNN they, they have no respect for Donald Trump. Oh, you may not like him. Okay, I don't care you you are you, you may not like him, but guess what? He's still a former president and he need that respect. Okay, and when he talk, you should shut up. When a president is talking, I you don't call him off. When Joe Biden is talking, I I never see anybody call Joe Biden off. I don't see CNN or Fox News or any, any other news network call Joe Biden off when he's talking. No, they're going to allow him to talk first. After talking, that's when you talk. You give, the, uh, you give this man a question and he's trying to answer the question, but you are cutting him off. I just watched that. This is the reason people don't watch CNN. This is the reason people people don't watch CNN. Okay, they talk about a lot of a lot, a lot of important things. Uh, they talk about the border. They talk about immigrant. They talk about election. They talk about uh, the sexual insult cases. They talk about they talk about Russia and Ukraine. What pissed me off the most, ladies and, ladies and gentlemen, is a Russian and Ukraine situation, right? She asked Trump, "Whose side are you choosing? Are you for Russia or are you for Ukraine?" What a stupid question. When he told you, he said, when Trump said, listen, what is happening between Ukraine and Russia need to stop. I want it to stop. If I was president, I would end this war in 24 hours. But yet you are asking him, to, he should choose which size. Bro, that's a stupid thing. Okay? Okay, why would United States pay 180 billion dollars to Ukraine and 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 Europe and Europe would have paid on the bill. We are not part of a uh, uh, damn Ukraine is part of European Union. That's the people. But anyway, when Trump say I want the war to end, and uh, uh, she wants Trump to choose sides. Are you for Ukraine or are you for Russia? What a stupid thing. Nobody is for anybody here. Enough is enough. Killing of innocent people need to stop. Okay, this is the reason Trump gonna win the election 2024 because everybody watch it. Americans saw what happened. Oh, and the and 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 the so-called sexual case against Trump. It don't make sense. Trump said, "I don't know this woman," but you are telling Trump, "Oh, they say you know this woman." Do you know why it me? If a man had to swear on his children. Do you have any idea why it me? Well, I want a man swore on his children. Ladies and gentlemen, American people, Trump swore. This is my first time seeing Donald Trump swore on his children that he never knew this woman. But yet, you are telling Trump, oh, but the people say you are guilty, but the people say you are dead. People say, people say what? Then, then she attacked Trump on the border. Trump said, we build a boat, uh, we build a wall, and the wall is almost finished. But she said, no, no, you wouldn't build 25. I are you not so be a journalist? Go to the border, go find out. If Trump built 25 or he built almost the border. Go there and find out. Go find out. Don't be in your office and tell Trump why what he did, what he didn't do. Have you ever been to the border before? Lady, I'm talking to you. Have, you. have you ever been to the border? No. None of you guys have stepped their foot to the border before. But yeah, you want to defend the border. Now you want to defend immigrants. 
Bro, this so-called CNN town hall meeting was good for Donald Trump. Why? Because it exposed CNN. I'm telling you, CNN got exposed today. They got exposed today. Why? Because they are being paid by somebody. I don't know who's paying CNN. Somebody out there is paying the network to lie to the American people, to confuse the American people. But thank God, after two years on a new job, body, the eyes of American people are opening. Okay? Okay? Oh, and believe me, all, all these people on CNN, they're going to lie. Oh, my God. Go watch CNN right now. They're going to be, they're going to stop lying and lying and lying and lying and lying and lying. What Trump didn't say? They will misquote his word. They will, do, you know, do you know what I love about CNN? They will take a sentence from what Trump is saying and, and they, will, they will make a big deal out of it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Somebody who swore on his children and said, I don't know this woman. I believe that person. Over any other resort. Because we all know at the end of the day, every lawsuit against Trump ain't not to be false. <laughs> every lawsuit against Trump at the end of the day ain't not to be a false lawsuit. Okay? Uh, I, 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 I just gave my input on what, on what I saw on CNN. I just realized that CNN was sold to somebody. Somebody is, is controlling CNN. That person is invisible. I don't know who they are because whatever I saw to do on CNN is a disgrace. Okay? It's a pure disgrace or disgrace for you to disrespect an American president like that. You may not like Trump, but she never allowed Trump to answer questions that, that are very important. Let's just say he's lying. Okay? Who are you to cut him off when he's speaking? Oh, he received a question to answer, but you are cutting him off. You don't even allow him to finish his sentence. You don't even allow him to finish what he wants to say. Can you do that to Joe Biden? Can you do that to Obama? Nah, I, hey, you can't do that to them. You allow Joe Biden to speak. You allow Obama to speak. You allow all these people to say whatever they want to say. Then you can talk. If you have anything to say, why don't you wait until the president is done with his statement and answer the question that was asked to him? Bro, CNN just exposed themselves as fake news. <laughs>